Gotta got your fucking self shot today, it's your problem. Stand up. S stand up. As the suspect was taken away, his friend refused to leave the scene. You have to get going. Otherwise, we are gonna put the cops back on you. You're gonna be arrested for, for disorderly conduct. I'm not doing nothing. You're, you are being disorderly. This is what we go through every day. Yeah. Every day. Cops. They are Hell. under control. We did see that guy. There was a young guy that was taken down who had a little pistol in his pocket. And so, uh, in that respect, it seemed to be... Niggas with guns is out of control, too, but these cops is out of control. That stop and frisk shit is that's, out of control. Somebody called about you. They gave your description, your shirt, your pants, your shoes. They said that... You know, I can go radio and have, let you hear it again. Well, yes, we did get a gun. Show them the gun. We got the gun. All right? See, the problem was they called about him. His bull had the gun. All right? So, see, now, were we wrong? Well, we got a gun on the street. Now, 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 let's take, let's take it a different, let's take it a different twist now, right? Since you're bringing it up. Let's say dude wants to start shooting and your little man gets hit. Then what? Then I gotta get my gun and come out here and start shooting. That's the problem that we have. That's the problem that we have, and that's what we're here doing. We do. You understand that? So now we prevented that. That's it. So we took a gun off. We took a gun off the street. We took a gun off the street, and we possibly saved someone's life. Yeah, y'all saved somebody's life. Yeah. Now if he had shot him, you'd be mad at us. All right. Well, let me ask you this. Y'all jumped out on me the other day. I didn't jump out on you. That's the first time I ever met you. No, I'm not saying y'all. You know, but I'm saying the police jumped out on me, slapped me all on the grill. I ain't got nothing on me. They locked a hundred niggas up. They got shit on them. They gonna ask me, what you doing out here? You smoke crack? I don't smoke crack. I work every day, you know? All right. But y'all got me gripped up. Got all these niggas gripped up. And then it's a big problem. Ain't no niggas up in here. Ain't no niggas up in here. Baby stuff. Stop moving your arm. Handcuffs too tight. The more you move, the tighter they're going to get, all right? Stop, stop, stop. Wait, hold up. Stop, stop, stop. I'm going home. No, you're not. I'm going home. I'm going home. This is what you get in America right here. This is what you get in America. What's your name, man? You okay? Sarge? You okay? You okay? Yeah. No problem. Not for norm. What are you all high? Get in the car! Come on, you just... Get in the car! Are you keeping an eye on everything? Yeah. yeah. Why? Yeah. Just in case something breaks out, what you want to do is you want to watch people coming in from behind. And, uh, so it doesn't get out of control? Yes. It, does that ever happen? It does. What happens? Bottles, bricks. Really? Yeah, it'll start what? throwing things. Many riots? But they really don't know him, so we're in pretty good shape with him. So they, they, he's not from the neighborhood. It's a, like a little war zone in a way. Yes, it is. It is. Why? It is. It's just, you know what it is? It's just, it's just the way of the nature of the streets, like we were saying before. You have all the, uh, the drugs and uh, I think the like the man with the gun, he may have been high, high, want something, and uh, it's just the way of the streets.